Nikki, describe to the viewers how annoying I am on a Sunday. Very annoying. What do I want to live with him. What do I do? What did you do this morning? I, I was literally. In bed, all wrapped up, and he goes, let's go for a walk. Opens the curtains, drags the duvet off, pushes me out of the bed. I literally wake up in the morning, and like, all I want to do is just get out and get outside. I'm just such a, I'd hate just sitting still and laying there and doing nothing like in a dark room. So literally, we got up Sunday morning, eight o'clock, went for like a, a 4,000 step walk. How long did it take us? Like 30 minutes or so? Mm -hmm. Came back, made protein pancakes, walked up to the shops, come back. Now I'm like, let's go out, let's go for lunch. So, yeah. I'm like the worst person to live with ever. We are off to Tunbridge Wells to go check out a relatively new pizzeria called Estro. It looks good, it's like Neapolitan style pizza, so. It looks pretty decent, but I hope you enjoyed the video today, guys. If you do, please do give it a thumbs up, and if you haven't already, please do. Subscribe to the channel. Because man's got to get to 100 subscribers, you feel me? Pantarts have got a little food thing going on and it looks sick. They've got like brownies, salted caramel brownies, Oreo cheesecakes, macaroons. So we'll probably head over there again post pizza. <laughs> A pepperoni pizza. I'll give you a live taste test once I have ended up cutting this thing. It's like a thick crust but nice and thin. Look at that. Woo! <laughs> oh. Out of 10? 8. 8. Mm. 8.2. Not too bad. Monday the 16th of September and I thought I'd take you guys through a full day of eating as I haven't done one of these in a long time. As you guys know, I'm currently running a gaining phase so I am eating in a slight caloric surplus. My current calorie content is 3,400 calories and protein is sitting at around about 180 grams per day. I don't track specific numbers within my fats and carbohydrates just because I don't need to and I like having the flexibility within just tracking calories and protein. Meal one is gonna be like a egg fried ricey sort of thing. I've got 100 grams of long grain rice. I've got four eggs, loads of veggies and a bit of soy sauce on top. I mix it all together in a pan and it is more bueno. I will put the calories and macros on the screen now. So let's go eat some food. In for a push dominant upper body session. I've got a total of eight working sets on chest. I think six working sets on delts and then four working sets on back. Let's see what we can do. Very productive session in the books. Everything was progressed within either volume or intensity, so I am pleased. Box ticked. Post workout meal, blah, blah, blah. Just going back to the gym now to eat my post workout meal. Went for a little walk after my workout just to get some steps in. And also popped into prep to do a little bit of work. But um, yeah, post workout meal is going to be a pack of Thai jasmine rice, 110 grams of chicken, and loads and loads of veggies. I'll put the macros and calories on the screen. Yeah. Let's go eat some food because I am really hungry actually. I'm eh? um, the reason why I'm not filming it in the staff room. I'm just like showing you over the top of this clip is because the lighting in the staff room is, is horrendous and it really annoys me. So yeah, bit of OCD. I've literally been sitting in prep for the last few hours, just trying to figure out and actually understand how to use Photoshop. I downloaded it yesterday to up my thumbnail game, um, but it is so confusing. So if my thumbnails do look a bit weird or do look a bit sort of 
um, messy over the next few weeks. It's literally just because I'm trying to understand how to use it properly and all that sort of stuff. But it's cool. It's cool. I'm looking forward to getting used to it and, and making my thumbnail game as strong as I can. I thought the lighting in this room was going to be really bad, but it's actually not too bad. So meal three is going down. I've got exactly the same thing as I had earlier. Pack with jasmine rice, 110 grams of chicken with veggies and sriracha on top. It's probably one of my favourite meals. I literally love it. After this, I've got evening clients, and then I will show you guys what I'm going to eat for my dinner later on. Finally home from work. The time is precisely 9.51, and I need to cook up some food because I am starving. You ready for this montage in three, two, one? going down we have got 120 grams of ground rice 20 grams of 85 percent dark chocolate 20 grams of lotus biscoff um, spread and 40 grams of whey protein made into a sludge and poured on top i'll put the calories and macros on the screen now i'm going to eat this because it's getting late and i'm very hungry as you guys can see, I'm finishing the day off with an obscene amount of Cocoa Pops. I've got 160 grams with 300 mils of unsweetened almond milk. I will put the calories and macros on the screen. And I'm also going to finish the video here. So that is a full day of eating on 3,400 calories. I'll put the total calories on the screen as well and also the total macronutrient breakdown. I think I did get, what did I do? Yeah, I got 180, mate, no way. Literally, you won't be able to see it on there, we won't focus. Let's see if we can do this, come on, boy. If you can see that, 180 grams of protein on the money. And the reason why, the reason behind me having an obscene amount of Cocoa Pops before bed is literally just because I hadn't eaten my calories. And I need to get some calories in, and Cocoa Pops are very easy to eat. So, yeah. That is it. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed the video today, guys. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please do subscribe to the channel because we need to get to 100 subscribers. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Much love.